Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Last Story with me, Rock Paper Mario. Now, I don't know where we're supposed to go here. I, I don't know, like, are we supposed to go up here or something? There's like some... No, that's the ship's wheel. This is like, um, where Jean-Luc Picard would have been. There's like stuff up there. I don't know how to get back up there. I think what we have actually just have to do is climb this ladder here. Because what we need is a lizard with a ladder. Yeah, there's not much going on today. Today is the... Actually, there is... Speaking of which, today is August 14th, the day that, as far as I know, oh no, we're being watched again. As far as I know, the last story is actually being released in America today. So if you are in America and you are planning on getting it, then congratulations, you finally have it. Okay, let's just pole, can we pole vault over, oh no, it's B, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Pole vault over, and that's so fun. I could just do that all day. What's this smell? It smells good. What is it? Maybe it's, it's Gamora shrimp stew and roast pheasant in campo sauce. Oh, and they're served with some freshly baked whole wheat bread. <laughs> you can tell that from here. Wow. Okay, yeah, this that's another thing about Marania. Like all the hey, way look, throughout the whole game. The table served. Interesting. Wait, that means someone's still alive. What's oh, that noise? Let's tuck in. Oh please. Don't think about it, Narania. It might be poisoned. But, um, that's like a running gag all the way through this game. Like, how hungry Morania is always is. And how she loves food and how she eats so much. But, like, look at her! Do you like, anyway? Because they're always, like, don't remember that he looks like a muffin and all this kind of thing. And now... Oh, no. Is this Silent Hill 3 town? Is it? Is this Silent Hill 3 town? Get out of my way, Dagra. <gasps> oh no, it's Luigi's Mansion Town. I was kind of getting scared there for a moment. Dad! Yurik! Oh, this is where the captain's quarters is, I presume. Let let's look up here first. Oh, that's a mirror. I guess he's still young. Maybe we don't know Yurik as well as we think we do. Maybe we don't know any of each other as well as we think we do. Another magic dagger there, just in case you don't have one for, uh, for both Yorick and Morania. Hey, how did you guys get up here so quickly? I kind of like a, I was just going to say, I kind of like a save point right about now. Um, and they gave us one. <laughs> what do you know? Might as well save up here, let me see. Uh, this one. There we go. But yeah, that's, what, like, um... I was like Dagron, like he's still young. No, no matter what age you are, if you if your father has Yurik, that kind of a question mark you, hanging over him okay. and he's dead now, you're gonna want to find out what happened. Do you know? No doubt about it, Dad. Oh dear. That is a uh, captain's log. This is Dad's writing. Star date it's something. It's been a week since we've been adrift. We still we haven't, haven't seen land, that. and the crew are in a terrible state. No mast, no rudder. The ship is like a huge coffin, bobbing up and down on the waves. All hope is lost for us. So Dad was shipwrecked. But how? Why? The skies were totally clear. <laughs> well, maybe... Well, I don't know. I don't even want to answer that question. Where is he? Is he over here? Oh, I'm kind of worried about this one. There's like a boss coming up here. And I did it on my first try the last time, but... Maybe this is Silent Hill 3 country. Hmm. It's just a plain old mirror. No! That isn't me. Yeah, look, he's not copying you. It's something else. Some sort of vile spirit. Okay, I don't know how to... I can't remember how to do this. I think we have to like draw him out of the mirror or something. Look, a magic circle in the mirror. 
Can you draw it into the circle? Oh, I think we have to like, yeah, we have to like make him walk into the circle. That's what we have to do now. I remember. Oh, he's dancing in the flames. Yeah, he doesn't like that, this is does our he? Big chance. Or maybe it's just a chance. Zayon, let him have it. What do you mean, let him have it? We can't walk into there. Oh, so we. Oh, well, here we go. Come on, into the flames. No, we have to like walk up there. Okay, it's like. See, this is the thing. It's actually a pretty complicated little battle. I think so. Anyway, He's dancing in the flames. You see, I don't know what. Like, what do you suppose? What do you mean? Let him have it. I think we've hit him like a bit, but. But now he's just after making me like all sticky. I don't know what we're supposed. This is like one of those battles that I just didn't like. I just wasn't sure what they wanted me to do. Yeah, see, because, like, they say, like, he's after killing me twice now. Oh, we have to shoot him. to move differently to Zale. That's the signal. Got it. Okay, come on. Come on, shoot her! Shoot her! Okay, we're on to the second phase. Okay, that's- I just get- was I not talking there? I swear that I must have stopped talking for like five minutes there, because I just didn't know what we were supposed to do. You're supposed to shoot- jeez, get off of me! Get off of me, but they look like the, those things in Kingdom Hearts. Get off. Stupid. What are they? Why are they copying what we do? Bet they made that fake food too. Yeah, that's what you're worried about, the food? What the heck? Armor break. Oh yeah, we're like you have to like avoid attacking your party members, that's it. Oh so that's fake Morania, okay. And that's like fake uh your I presume. Oh no, that was real, Yorick, sorry. Fine, That's the fake one, with the red thing above it. Hey, you know it's me, right? No, I didn't. Hey, you know it's me, right? Hey, you know it's me, right? Hey, use my magic circle. You can steal away enemy's magic. Use the magic circle? Okay, 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 Morani, I hear you, I hear you, I hear you. There we go. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh no, now I remember. Now I remember, I even remember your name. They used to call you Jawbone. You have to use the nature one. Okay, power strike, power strike, uh, flare, on whatever, and leaf. Over here. Somewhere in the middle. Come on, Marania, come on, Marania. Here we go. Is, is leaf up already? There it is. Silence. Okay, now they can't use their magic. Just attack the one that looks like Zale. I don't know what's going on. This is just like one of those times where like I didn't know what to do. It's a very confusing little boss battle. Is this the real one? Oh no, that's Yorick's dad. Well, he's definitely dead. Hey, you know it's me, right? Well, stay out of my way then. Okay, there's only one left now. Silence. Hey, you know it's me, yeah, look, right? he looks like real. Okay, he's dead now. Okay. Is he? Did we beat them all? Oh yeah, we did. <laughs> okay, there we go. Big botched boss battle, ahoy! I'm telling you, that one really confuses me. But I have no regrets. Together, my men and I defeated that giant monster. Giant monster. And of this, I am truly proud. I think some other monsters headed towards the island, but I have good faith that the villagers fought them away. However, 
The foul monster we bested was of a different caliber. No one could have faced it but us. Though no one in the village will ever know, my men and I fulfilled our duty as warriors. And so I leave behind this my final log. If someone should read this, I implore you to let the villagers know of our fate. Tell them we fought bravely until the bitter end. And please tell my beloved wife and son. The two of you were in my thoughts until the very end. And I love you dearly. I love this chapter. This is probably Father. my favorite chapter in the game. Dad! He died to protect us. But well, one of them, anyway. There's another pretty, really cool couple of ones later on in the game. I finally learned the truth about my dad. Yep. Found out he Thank wasn't you. a coward at all, after all. Look at that smile. Do you know, I mean... For someone who never smiles, to see them smile is something to behold, you know? But like... I mean, imagine how that must feel for him to finally have some... Some closure about what actually happened all that time ago, you know? I don't know. It just must feel pretty great, you know? It must push his mind at ease. Everything changed for Yurik that day. The his Grinch's heart grew three heart times. Finally began to warm, thanks to his father's words and the kindness of his friends. Aww. With a warm smile of genuine gratitude, Yurik started to come to terms with his past. The end of the chapter. Yeah, it's not a long one, but it's definitely one of my favorites. As I say, there's another couple of ones later on that are really freaking cool as well. And we got the Memento Dagger. Let's talk to Yorick. I'll show you that Memento Dagger Zale. in a sec. About what you did back there. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I think I was confused. About a lot of things. I'm sorry. Don't worry, we'll forgive You've you. You've got it wrong, Yorick. At times like this, there's no need to say sorry. Aww. You just Zale said, just seems to know you. exactly what to say all the time. I don't yes, know why. Course. Sorry, I mean, thank you. Oh, I love that chapter. Okay, this weapon. Um, that weapon we just got. Uh, the memento dagger. That is... Where is it? it? That is a dagger, like... A dagger that belonged to Yorick's father, Yorick only, no attributes. But, like, it, as you can see, like, it does lower his magic attack a little bit. But, like, it doesn't, it hasn't been upgraded yet. This is, as far as I know, Yorick's ultimate weapon. Like, you can't, like, get any better than this, because wait till you see how amazing this becomes if we go down to Memento Dagger. Yeah, look, you need a pirate ring to upgrade it. Magic attack, with one upgrade, goes up from 55 to 150. So let's just upgrade it right now. Um, with another upgrade, goes up to 185. Which, see, and then you need the Noble Ring. Um, if you upgrade it with the Noble Ring, then you'll get a uh, casting speed plus 50%, but at the moment, no, we don't. Um, uh, but, like, you can just see, like, now, if we, uh... Yeah, no, I don't need your undead frickin' edge. Um, if you just look now, what, what difference that is already... Uh, Memento Dagger plus two. Yeah, look, 425 he'd have with the Magic Dagger plus three, and now he has 491. And the, the main thing about that Memento Dagger is as you upgrade it, you continually, like, it, it puts up his uh, casting speed just ridiculously. It really does. What's up with you? The boat's all bent, so the door won't open. Hold on, I'll have it fixed in a jiffy. Yeah, I, I don't know, We th this video still has a, wait a second, what's in there? Oh no, that's just the door off this door. It's not like a second door. We can go to the appraisal man now, where's he? 
Is, oh, there he is. And get that, like, I'll show you now that question mark sword. You might find weapons from time to time. Yeah, I know. If I told do. the good people already. Appraise. See, we have two. Uh, appraise. And it is a fang. I do not know what that is. I think... It's useless as far as I know. Blunt copper sword. We can just sell that. Yeah, let's go down and, like, sell all our stuff. Because, uh... We don't need it anymore. Well, a lot of it, you know. Sell. Actually, let's see what that, like, a uh, fang is like. Who can actually equip it? I think that might be, like, a weapon for... Oh, he can equip it. A sword crafter from the skin and teeth. I'm pretty sure that knight sword is still better. But at least it's there for Seren or whatever. That'll trickle down to her. Yeah, we might as well keep that fang so if it's better than what Seren has at the moment. But we can sell the blunt copper sword. Um, we can probably sell that as well. I'm not going to use it at the moment. And sell that. Uh, yeah, we can sell all these as well because I'm not going to use them. Callista's ball gown. I don't know if you can upgrade that. I must have a look at that. I don't think you can. It'd be really interesting if you could, because it does give, like, a... Look at all this crap we have. It does give, um... We'll hang on to these magic daggers, just in case we need them for Lowell, but... Uh, upgrade equipment. I wonder if you can upgrade her, uh, ball gown. That'd be interesting. No, you can't. I think you might get a special piece of armor for her later that you can upgrade, but I'm not... Is there any person's armor that we haven't upgraded? No, everything's plus one, and we have some gnome copper. Well, let's just build up some gnome copper, so... Man, this video is going over time. I don't think we need an undead edge. Is there anyone whose clothes we need to change, that we changed? No. Well, do you know what, guys? I'm gonna save up if I can come across the save point. Um, and in the next part, we'll try and find Morania and do the second chapter, the Morania one, or whatever. I think it's in there. Anyway, see you next time guys, and thanks a million for watching. I'll see you next time and let's play the last story. Bye!